and welcome to Leicestershire. How excited are you to be here? Yeah, it's obviously great to happen so soon. Um, I feel like it's been the worst kept secret in the world the past sort of month or two. Uh, but it's nice to be able to come out on loan straight away and certainly want to make a difference straight away starting Sunday. You've had your first session with the lads getting to beat them safe. How do you find that? For years, that training block out the back there is the best in the country by far. Uh, and just being able to face bowlers for the first time today for in a net session for a long time um, is cracking facility uh, and just great practice in general. Obviously moving from Worcestershire, you've been there all your career, presumably a really tough decision for you to make. What were the motivations behind that decision and why you saw Leicestershire as the right club for you? Well, Leicester wanted me all formats and that was the deciding factor. I want to be playing all formats of cricket. I'm only 31 years old. I like to think I've still got a few more years left in the tank and the opportunity to play certainly red ball cricket again and then obviously try and contribute here in, to more white ball success. Obviously you've got big game, the final on the 16th. There's already success happening. I hope to just add to that in the, in the near future. You mentioned already to me about the initial conversations you had with Claude Henderson and James Taylor. What was said in there to convince you from the get-go? Just the element of feeling valued. Uh, they showed real interest. Look, we want you. You can come in, be a senior player. You've obviously played, I've played a lot of cricket now. Come in and try and influence the group as best as I can. Um, but it was just that, I don't know, I've known Titch for years. Um, it was the first time I've really met Claude in person, but I just got a great sort of vibe off him. Uh, he made me feel very welcome, almost at home straight away. Even first thing this morning, got out of the car, he was straight to my door, showing me around. It's just that feeling of feeling valued again, which has been like a huge, huge perk. You mentioned the way the team going through to the final um, of the One Day Cup. What have you made of the size performances this year and the direction of travel that the club seems to be going on? It's been unbelievable, hasn't it? Um, just the, the manner of results, just going to the Oval, winning there, just winning everywhere you've gone, um, just stands the club in good stead for the next, the next few years. Um, and hopefully, like I said, add to that in, in certainly white ball cricket. And talking of red ball cricket, you could be in line to make your debut this Sunday against Gloucestershire. You haven't played as much in recent times in that format as you would have liked, but you're feeling raring to go? Yeah, 100%. I've, I've wanted to play, it's just I've been left out of selection. I've been fit all summer. Um, my greatest attribute is behind the stumps, trying to make a difference behind the stumps and then hopefully with the bat making contributions and trying to affect the game as I can. Um, as a naturally aggressive batsman, um, I'm looking forward to having my, certainly my family here on Sunday and what should be another cracker of a day. And obviously you join at a time when the club's still in the promotion hunt as well. How exciting is it to join at the business end of the season when there's really something to play for? Well, that was part of the reason why I would mentioned it to Claude. Um, can I come on loan? Uh, I obviously wasn't playing. Uh, Worcester pretty much told me that I wasn't going to be involved in their plans. So I wanted to come out and try and make a difference this year because I know they're in the hunt. Obviously, we won, we're one win away from promotion. I think Worcester are 130, we're 111. Um, so one win and we're alongside that, that second place promotion spot. And just finally for Foxes fans, what can they expect from you as a player and the way you go about your cricket? Nothing different from what I've done. I just genuinely give my all. I'm a very much a, a team man. Um, I'll always play for the team and I'll give my best for this club. 